are now going to talk about section 3.3.5, the shape and mode of the poison distribution. Now, the point and shape of the poison distribution is very similar to that of the binomial distribution. You can view from the lecture notes itself that the definitions has already been given. Now, what we will do is actually to go through example 12. How do we actually use the GC to help us find the mode? The method is very similar to that of the binomial distribution as well. First, let's take a look at the question itself. It says the type is mixed error at random and on average 3.4 errors per page. Find the most likely number of errors he makes on the page. Now, in order to do any statistical question, it's always very important for you to write down what is the random variable that we have in this question. Okay, and then you write down the equation that we have in order to help us understand the question better. Now, we'll move on to the GC component now. First, what we have is to simply just follow the instructions as given in the lecture notes. Simply press Y1 equals 2, which is over here. Now, next, press second distribution and then just scroll up and find option C which is poison dish PDF take note not to select option D which is poison CDF select this and just simply key in 3.4 comma X and close bracket after that which we press second table Okay, and on your GC, it will show you the table of values that X1 takes and Y1 takes as well. Okay. Now, from the table itself, it is very obvious that at option number 3, when X equals to 3, okay, the value of Y1 is actually the greatest at 0 0.21862. If you don't believe that it's the highest, you can simply just scroll down and take a look and you realize that the values of Y1 is actually decreasing for as X increases. Okay, so we just simply take the highest value of y1 and take it to be the mode of the distribution. And then the probability is greatest when x is equals to 3, as highlighted over here.